Hi guys and welcome to Miss Disney Reviews. Today I'm going to review this huge set from Play-Doh called the Cake and Ice Cream Confections. It includes many accessories like these three cards and two gift boxes, a lot of molds, cupcake station, ice cream station, and of course, cake station. It includes many accessories. So there are forks, spoons, and knives. There are two gift boxes, three cards, rolling pin, three stamps, four cakes, four cake cutters, these cones and glasses, and best of all, these 10 cans of Play-Doh, including these four special ones, best for ice cream and cakes. So you'll first attach one of the three stamps to the stamping arm at the cake station. Next you'll fill the cake with some Play-Doh on top and adjust it at the cake station. You can rotate the cakes with a little button at the bottom. Remove the excess dough and here's how it looks like with the stamp. It's pretty neat. So next you can put some play-doh underneath. Use the cupcake presser to push out the play-doh. Next I'm going to roll out some purple play-doh for the cake base. I'm using one of the four cutters. Just remove the excess play-doh. And here's how it looks like. So I have two tiers here. And then I'm going to put the cake top. Next you can use the molds to have some cutouts like these flowers. There are many molds but not as many as the other individual sets for cakes or ice creams. Here's the cake display. It has some molds underneath which you can use later. And here's my first cake. So how does it look? So here are four glasses and cones for ice creams. I'm going to use this glass first. So I'm going to put two colors of Play-Doh inside. Here's a fun scoop maker to add yummy scoops to your ice cream glass or cone. Here's a caramel drizzle. Here's the frosting maker. You can add any color that you like. I love white. Here I am adding a little extra decoration. And you can add a spoon at the end. So here's the cupcake station and I'm gonna add some purple and white play-doh. So you can fill the bottom and top or just add a lot of play-doh at once. So next you can just press down. Here's a cute little cupcake. I love this purple color. So now it's time to decorate. 
As I said, there are many modes that you can use. And I'm going to use this blue flower one. This is really cute. For the second cupcake, I'm going to use this really fun technique. So you press down the strip of Play-Doh on the molds of flowers or leaves or anything that you like. Press it with the rolling pin. And here you have a nice strip of flowers. So I'm going to put it in the cupcake station. Press it down. And here you have a really cute decorated cupcake. You can use any design that you like. There's so many ways to do it. Add some fun colorful frosting. And use some molds to add some extra decoration like hearts, stars, flowers or anything that you like. And here's the final look. This one's too adorable. Now for the third cupcake, I'm going to add this pink scoop. You can always mix colors of Play-Doh to get other colors. So you can use the dark pink and white. There's a little rainbow that I made with strips of Play-Doh. And add flowers as clouds. Isn't this cute? Here are all the three cupcakes that I made. Here's a double-ended scoop with a cupcake shape and round. You can mix and match colors. They kind of look like jellies. So for my second cake, I'm going to use this blue play-doh and use the second cake stamper. Press it down. There are three tiers of cakes. And here's the topper. Here are some cream swirls that I made with the molds. You can always add extra toppings like stars and triangles. Now at the back of the knife, there is a mold for a really tall birthday cake. So I'm going to use that. And here we have a candle. You can decorate the candle with these lines of Play-Doh. Or you can make other designs like swirls or anything else that you like. And here's a candle for my birthday cake. So to make the next glass of ice cream, I'm going to add alternate colors of green and white and fill it up to the top. Add a scoop of special green Play-Doh. I'm adding a two-tone frosting on top. 
and stars. And it's ready to eat with a spoon, so you can't eat it. So you can use the bottom of the cake stand as a star mode. You can top the cake with the star, cut it with a knife and use the cake server for a piece of cake. So there are a bunch of molds, not as many as you'll find in other individual Play-Doh playsets like Ice Cream Shop or the Frosting Fun. But they're enough to give you a lot of decorations for your ice cream and cakes. Now this set comes with extra accessories like birthday cards or gift boxes. So go ahead and invite your friends and arrive at the birthday with these gift boxes or send them away with treats in these boxes. So guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it. And please do subscribe to my channel Miss Disney Reviews to get updates on new videos. Thank you for watching.